Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm Erin, if you guys are new here. It's been a little bit since I made a video. Life got a little bit crazy, but I'm gonna be getting back to doing weekly videos. So if that's something you're interested in, make sure you subscribe to the channel. This video, I'm just gonna take you guys with me for a couple days and vlog a little bit of my life. So let's get into it. Wanna go get a pup cup? Lambo and I have had a Starbucks tradition for the past couple months. I've been obsessed with this drink. So he gets a pup cup and I get my coffee. So that's what we're gonna go first. Do a little fit check just super basic. These Converse are literally my favorite shoes right now. Absolute favorite joggers. I wear these all the time. I'll link this entire outfit in the description. I'm just going to throw on this puffer vest. Yeah. It's 32 degrees outside. Yeah, I probably should have got an actual jacket. Cool. Gonna go get a nice coffee now because it doesn't matter what temperature it is. I'm always going to get a nice coffee. I get the brown sugar oat milk shake and espresso, but I sub out the brown sugar syrup for apple brown sugar syrup and it tastes like apple cider coffee. It is so fucking good. So let's go pick it up. I need caffeine. As far as things I have to do today, um, I'm going to the Apple store in a little over an hour. My camera does not work at all. So finally have an appointment today. And then I also have leg day today. I have a pretty hard workout. I have a couple maxes programs. So I'm not like anxious, but I have that like feeling of knowing that I have to like perform today. And I'm like, it's, it's like an excitement, nervous, maybe I am a little anxious, I don't know. I have a deficit deadlift programmed. I'm hoping that I can get 285. I don't know how it's gonna go, we'll see. And then I've got some editing to do. I'm working on my app that's coming very, 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 very soon. So I've gotta do some work for that, but nothing too crazy. There he is. is he? Oh, he goes by the window and waits. Hi, I just have a mobile order for Aaron. Aaron? Yeah, thank you. Look at that man waiting patiently for his pup cup. So the double smoked sandwich is so fucking good. I get it occasionally. It's got 26 grams of fat in it, so it's definitely not something I can eat like every single day because that's pretty high fat for a breakfast sandwich, but 12 out of 10. Secure the goods can't see anything. <laughs> Normally I'd be walking on my treadmill desk and working, but today I have that leg day that I was talking about where I have some maxes programs. So I don't really want to do any like cardio or really any activity before I do that. I just don't want to take away from the output that I can do in that workout. So I'm just going to sit here and do some work. I'm working on my app. Like I said earlier, I need to upload a bunch of videos so you guys can know how to do the exercises that are programmed. I need to send some emails, editing some videos, and probably make an Instagram post because I don't think I posted in like five days. Also kind of random, but since I live alone, I hate silence. I always have a podcast or music or a show on or something. Like I just can't exist in silence. It like freaks me out. So this YouTube channel is one of my absolute favorite go-tos for like productivity. It's like a music channel. It's called Chill Out Lounge. Highly recommend. I've noticed when I have it on that I like can't stop moving. Like I just am super productive. So Chill Out Lounge, it's live. It runs like 24 seven. But yeah, I'll check in with you guys in a little bit. Okay, on my way to get my phone fixed, the camera like does not work at all. Like literally if I try to swipe, it's just a black screen, like nothing works. If I go to Instagram, it's just a black screen. I'm trying to make any sort of content and I literally cannot use my phone camera. It's been horrible. So I'm gonna go to the Apple store and see what the deal is. Okay, I successfully fixed my phone. It was like an hour and a half appointment, but also got a new phone case. And I have my camera back, so super exciting. I don't know why I'm out of breath. I feel like maybe because it's super cold, but. Also, I went to Nordstrom. I needed to get some boots because I don't really have any. I did a little bit of damage. I got three pairs of boots and a sweater. When I get home, I'll show you what I got. This is my favorite thing ever. Goonie. Hello. Good morning. Are you snoozing? Come here. I want to see you. Hello. He's a good boy. Is he happy to see me? Oh, hello. Okay, I want to take him on walk super quick and then I'll show you guys what I got from Nordstrom. I just got back from the walk. Let's open the Nordstrom thing. First thing I got, Ugg slippers. I just wear slides all the time and now it's way too cold for that. So I've been wearing slides outside and my feet are literally freezing. So we had to switch to some slippers. I got the green ones. I'm f so excited about these. They're so comfy. I'll also link all these shoes in the description. Like I'll make a post in my like to know it and link it in the description so you guys can find these specific shoes. But let's 
Let's try them on. One thing about Uggs is they fit super tight at first because they like stretch out a little bit. So I feel like the first couple weeks I'm always like, damn, I should have got a bigger size. And then once they stretch out, I'm happy I did it. So just something to know. If you're half size, just size down. So I'm an eight and a half and I just got an eight. The next pair I got is a pair of Steve Madden's. I've been wanting these since last year. I never ended up buying them, but I just think they're like a really cute casual booty for like jeans and a sweater, leggings and a sweater, but I love them. Also my allergies in Colorado are so, so bad. At first I thought I was just sick, but then when I went to Tulum, it, they left completely. And then when I went to Morgantown, they left completely. And every time I come back to Denver, my allergies are just so bad. Okay. Let's see what these look like. I also love how I'm trying these on with sweatpants, but whatever. Ooh, these are really comfy. The top is kind of like a sock. Yeah. I will be wearing these a lot. Last pair of shoes I got by Open Edit. They're brown. Ooh, very, very much so like these. I like the pointed toe. I'm a big sucker for pointed toe booties. These are also on sale too. Are we joking? Let's try them on. Ooh, these are tall and also very comfy. I love pointed toe. Yeah, they're definitely a win. And last thing I got is this chunky sweater from Free People, it's just black. I just wanted something like this for like jeans and booties or leggings and I'm just such a basic like clothing person. I don't know, but I'll try it on so you guys can see what it looks like. Free People definitely has some of the best sweaters like quality wise and just like design wise, but this one, I'm gonna put it on over this like, shirt that I'm wearing. This is exactly what I was going for. Okay, gonna make one of my favorite like midday snacks, small meals. I don't eat like three big meals. I just kind of like eat every two to three hours throughout the day as I get hungry. But it's this Kodiak oatmeal. I put 84 milliliters of the core power in there and then I microwave it for 25 seconds and add some peanut butter. So let's do it. Also gonna have some pineapple. I am guilty of buying pre-cut fruit from Whole Foods just because it's easier. But then I'm gonna sit down and do some work for a couple hours. And then I'm gonna go to the gym and hit this leg day that I'm like, we're just not gonna think about it until we're there. But I'm excited to see what max is I'll hit. Yeah, we're just not gonna think about it. All right, time to work. <laughs> All right, we're gonna pick out the gym fit. First thing, it's leg day, so I'm gonna wear shorts. Probably gonna wear darker colored shorts. I'm thinking I'm gonna do these. And then for sports bra, I'll probably do, I'll probably do this guy. Full side by Lulu is like the best blue color ever. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I need to find some socks. I have lots of socks and they're kind of organized by like color and height. <laughs> Damn, I need to do laundry. All my white socks are on, I'll do these. And then for shoes, I'm gonna do some blazers. Probably gonna do these guys. These shoelaces are so long. Last thing, gotta grab a t-shirt and make my pre-workout. I have quite a selection of t-shirts and hoodies, but I think I'm just gonna go with, I'm gonna go with this guy. Also, Bucked Up is doing a huge Black Friday sale. It's the one sale they do every year. They do 50% off the entire website. You can use ETK50 and save 50% off. If you've ever been thinking about trying Bucked Up, now is definitely the time. I mean, pre-workout's literally like 20 bucks. My pre-workout is also part of it. My t-shirts are not a part of it. They're off the website, but my mango ice cream pre-workout in Bucked Up and Woke AF are both part of the deal. This t-shirt is also part of the deal. It's vibe. So. ETK 50, 50% off the entire website, bucked up. Go shop. Speaking of my pre, about to make some mango ice cream. Absolute hands down best flavor. I'm gonna mix it with some creatine monohydrate. I take creatine every single day. Five grams every day. It doesn't matter what kind of creatine you take. You just wanna make sure that the ingredients listed are only creatine monohydrate like this one. And might as well get it while it's 50% off. Um, there's a creatine shortage, I think, but Bucked Up definitely has theirs in stock and it's not expensive. It's 50 servings. I think it's $30. I think it's $30. So right now it's literally 15 bucks for 50 servings, which is nuts. 
My pre-workout, you just have to try it. You have to try it. It's mango ice cream. I did eight different sample testings to make it. I almost added lime, I almost added coconut, but ended up just going with the OG mango ice cream because it's that fucking good. It's like, you taste it, it's like, you get a good amount of mango and then the aftertaste is like a vanilla ice cream. It's not like a punch in the face flavor. It's like a very subtle, I love it. I absolutely fucking love it. You guys have to try it. So I just mix it up with this. And then I like to add ice. I think it tastes better if it's cold. One of my favorite parts of the day. Cheers. Also, I always have one of these before I go to the gym. It's good carbs, they digest quickly, and also it's just kind of like a routine thing for me. So I grab these, I grab all my camera equipment. My camera's currently charging, so I've got to charge it. And then we're gonna head to the gym. My car is extremely dirty and I definitely need a car wash, but remote start season is upon us. All right, I don't know how much I'm gonna film at the gym because I have a feeling I'm gonna get like in the mindset of like being super into this workout and not wanting to pull out my camera, but I'll definitely film my deadlift max. Drive to the gym definitely sets the tone for how the workout's gonna go, at least for me. Like I need good music, I need good pre-workout. I just like, I get mentally ready. And then when I show up to the gym, I'm like, I'm there, so. Finished the lift, hit 285 for my deadlift max, and I'm pretty fucking impressed with that. My regular deadlift max is 295, so hitting 285 at a deficit means my regular is probably over 300, which I've been waiting for all year, so can't wait to test that soon. But heading home from the gym now, got my fair life. I always have one of these after the gym. Listening to music driving the sun is setting right now and yeah life is good nothing beats this moment a hard ass lift pushing through and then driving home and just feeling like on top of the world i'm gonna go take lambo on a walk we do it every day after the gym before the sun sets and lately i've been in kind of a time crunch because the sun sets at like 4 30 now so I'm gonna go do that and then brian's sister's boyfriend is in town and we're gonna get dinner with him tonight so yeah we'll chat soon all right, I walked the dog and took a shower and then got into some comfy clothes because I have like a couple hours before I have to leave for dinner. So just gonna do some computer work. Currently editing the workout that I just did so I can put on my story and probably make some TikToks from it. And then gonna keep working on getting videos into my app. That is what is my most time consuming thing right now because I have to add like hundreds of videos into this app, which I'm super excited about, but it's just a lot of like tedious work of going through all my old videos and cropping like eight seconds of a good set to then import into the app. So that's what I'm doing. And then we'll get ready for dinner here in a little bit. Okay, just finished getting ready for dinner. Here is the fit. It's pretty casual. Also, this is a horrible angle, but wear my new boots. Sweaters from Lulu, Lulu Aligns. <clears throat> Colorado allergies. Shoes are Steve Madden. I showed them earlier and I got this little Louis bag. Brian's on his way here, and then we're gonna Uber there together just because we don't wanna deal with parking downtown, but probably not gonna vlog at dinner just cause I kinda wanna just go and like hang out. Uh, but we're gonna go get barbecue. I'm putting on this huge puffer long jacket. Wanna be in the video? Come here. Hello. Can I kiss? Thank you. He's the best. All right. We might chat tonight. We might resume in the morning. We'll see what happens. morning. I woke up like five minutes ago. I let the dog out because it's the first thing I do when I wake up and now I'm gonna wash my face and get ready for the day. So I just figured I would take you guys along with me for that part. I also sound really tired and my voice is like five octaves lower in the morning. I swear to God. I wake up sounding like a man. <laughs>
stopped recording and I didn't notice, so. outfit i'm just gonna do some computer work and then i might run a target to get some christmas decorations before i go to the gym so not gonna do anything crazy probably just more of like a lounge outfit which is what i wear every day but let's see what we figure out i think i'm feeling some navy today so i'm gonna do this lulu long sleeve shirt it's a whole tight long sleeve shirt and then these soft stream pants from lulu might be a little bit too much blue but i feel like it's vibe so yeah, it's kind of a lot of blue, but I don't really care. And it's really comfy, so we're just gonna we're just gonna roll with it. We got a good amount of snow in Denver last night, so it's gonna be boots for a minute. You know what time it is? Gotta go get Lambo a pup cup. We'll get a pup cup. Oh my! Are you okay? Are you okay? It is so cold outside. I literally grew up in Michigan, and I don't think I'll ever get used to the cold. Like, I still treat winter the same way I treated winter, <laughs> like, the first time I experienced it. I don't know. Like, this whole idea of, like, oh, yeah, I grew up in this place where it's really cold. Like, I can deal with it now. Like, no, I still can't deal with it. I'm still freezing, like, a good amount of the time. I don't like when my hands get cold. When my hands or my feet get cold, it's pretty much done. I do like driving in the snow, though, I will say. So look at how pretty it is. I'll flip you guys around so you guys can see. working on uploading a bunch of videos for my app and I have a bunch of emails to get back to and then I'm gonna work on editing a little bit of um, TikTok videos and working on this YouTube video. So I've got probably three to four hours of computer work. Not super exciting. I'm just gonna be sitting here. But I'll catch up in a little bit when I need a break from working. <laughs> I've been working for a few hours, my eyes hurt, and I need to stop staring at the screen. So I'm gonna split up my day by going to the gym. I have a leg day today. I'm actually gonna meet a girl there and train with her, which I'm excited about. So let's go pick out my gym outfit and get ready for the gym. All right. I think we're gonna go with these. Sports bra. I think I might just do black. Okay, sports bra. And for shoes, I just got these new blazers, so I think I'm gonna wear these today. I like these because I feel like they're like the OG blazer style, but they still have like a little bit of extra detail. I think for a t-shirt, I'm gonna do this one. It is the season of needing both sweatpants and a sweatshirt to go to the gym. Grab a hoodie. I'll literally look like a whole ass homeless person going to the gym. Like this is the fit. I've literally trained two hours a day, five days a week for like five years just to walk around like this. Let's make some pre. I think I'm gonna go with this guy. Tastes so good. I'm gonna mix it with, uh, yeah. I'm really sad because I ran out of creatine. I ordered it last week, but it hasn't gotten here yet. So I won't take it today. Hopefully it'll be here tomorrow, but it's not the end of the world. Um, anyways, Woke AF and Pumpocalypse both bucked up. Strawberry watermelon and watermelon. Banff and Woke AF have 333 milligrams of caffeine in them and they all taste super good. And then Pumpocalypse is a nitric oxide product, so it's gonna put more blood into your muscles and give you a better pump. I absolutely love this product. And mixing these two together tastes super good. Let's do it. I like how my shoes are sitting on the counter. Going up your sanitary. Cheers. I also need to make sure I have everything that I need as far as like filming and everything. Oh my god, going to the gym is like packing for a week vacation with how much stuff I bring. But also, this will be my first leg day with knee sleeves literally ever. And I'm really excited to see how it works. Brian keeps telling me to get them. He's like, dude, you're gonna squat so much more if you get them. 
So we're gonna try them out and I'm very interested to see how, how it goes. So just camera stuff. The fact that I'm gonna be bringing two pairs of shoes. I always make sure my camera's charged. Sometimes I show up at the gym and I forget. It's never a good time, 100%, let's get it. This gym bag also, I will link it in the description. Absolute best gym bag you will ever use. It's by Nike and there's so many compartments and it's huge. I travel with it, it's, it's the best, hands down. Like literally, how does that even, how does that even zip? There's, there's so much in there. Let's get it. I swear half my life is just putting on chapstick. I'm not sure exactly how much I'll film while we're at the gym just because I'm gonna be training with somebody. I'm filming on my other camera too, vertically. And then this camera's obviously horizontally, so I don't want to sit there and have like two cameras propped up filming me while I'm working out. I just feel like that's so self-righteous. <laughs> I can't do that. So I'll probably film a couple things. Um, we'll talk soon. That was such a good workout. I feel super strong. I hit all the numbers that I wanted to hit for my lifts. And it was really nice to train with somebody. I've been training with Brian for the past, like since we moved to Denver. So this is my first time training with someone else. And it was super nice to train with another girl and just like talk. And yeah, I just had a really good leg day. So I'm just gonna go home and I have a video call with my app designer to finalize some details. And then I'm going to work on editing some of the clips that I just filmed and work on this vlog so I can get it posted. So yeah, we'll chat soon. Do you have your croissant? Let me see your croissant. <laughs> Hi. Hello. You ever walk into your house and it immediately smells too good and you just know that you left a candle on? Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see, but I accidentally left a candle on. It smells really good in here, but Horrible fire hazard, I need to stop doing that. Normally I shower right after the gym, but this call is literally at 4.30, which is right now, so I have no time to do anything else. So I, it's just gonna be a super quick, like 15 to 20 minute call with the designers of my app to finalize like details and stuff. So I'll finish up this call and then go shower and then make some food. So I just wanna jump in. Um, we did get the edits for your brain guidelines. So we fixed the colors. Um, I did want to talk to you about the photos, um, the cover and avatar image. Okay, I want to do this one for that. We said we we're going to do two programs and then like a third category for if somebody didn't want to join the program and they just wanted to like train. Yeah, it would be like um, daily workouts or weekly workouts. Um, I just want to confirm uh, for the insights listed, we have custom macros, supplement guide, Spotify playlist, shop LTK, and then shop my Amazon. Do you still want yes. all of those? Or yes. Just some As you guys can see, there's a lot of exciting things coming. I'm very excited for them. I have a lot of work to do. And on that note, I'm gonna end the vlog here. I The rest of the night, I'm literally just gonna be on the computer editing and getting stuff ready for the app and some other things that are coming. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like this style of video, let me know. This is pretty easy for me to integrate into my life. So I can start taking you guys along with me for a couple days each week and just like showing you what I do and how I live my life and all the things. So if you guys like this video, let me know in the comments, subscribe to the channel if you guys want to see more and we'll catch you on the next video. See ya.